Hi everyone, Paolo here. So welcome to just another Bang How To channel. So picking up where we left off, uh, we installed WordPress on Google Cloud Compute. Now on this tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to set up the SSH to connect remotely on that instance and how to set up your FTP client on your Mac. So if you go back to your dashboard, uh, if you log into your Google Cloud, you eventually end up on your dashboard again. So just click on the hamburger icon here and then go under deployment manager. This would have the history of the deployment that you had. So it would contain basically everything where we left off last time. So there you have it. We have the IP address, we have the default username and everything. And from the last tutorial, I showed you how to check our login uh, using SSH from the browser. So this time we're gonna set up the SSH locally and then we'll connect to this one. To get started, uh, open up your terminal, which I already have here, and I'll zoom that in. Uh, what you would need is to generate uh, SSH keys. Uh, this would generate a private and public key. The public key is what you need to store on the Google Cloud, and when you connect, uh, with your client, it's going to authenticate against that public key. So on Mac, there's already a tool available which is called SSH Keygen, which allows you to create this. So command is SSH Keygen, and we're going to put a type of RSA. There's three types, so we're just going to cover RSA here. And we're going to put a flag and say um, create this. On the SSH folder and you could give it a file name the default file name is rd underscore RSA so we won't use that let's say uh, GC RSA and then you give it a comment um, for Google Cloud they prefer that you put the username so earlier we saw all ops minus the username, but because I use the WordPress certified by Bitnami package, they prefer you use the Bitnami username. So once you do that and you click that, it's gonna ask for a passphrase. So come up with a simple passphrase and it's gonna ask to verify again. And there you have it. So if I go to my SSH folder. And I do a list, you would see I have two new uh, files created there the GC RSA and the GC RSA pub. So the pub is the one you want to open and put on WordPress. So I mean on Google Cloud. So let's go back to Google Cloud and add that to the instance. So go to the hamburger menu icon. Uh, go to um, Compute Engine Click on your instance And at the bottom Section you have SSH here, but you need to click edit to get to the area where you need to add the SSH. So after clicking on edit, scroll down. As you can see here on this section, you have zero SSH key. Click on the show and hide there. Let's go back to my terminal. So I'm just gonna use VGC RSA pub to open the file. I'm gonna copy everything here and then paste it here. Let's make sure I got everything there. Yep. So as you can see, it added that um, it detected the username at the very end of the string and automatically populated for us. I just noticed something when I look at here. The firewalls are off, so let me just enable those and save. Cool. So it's now saved. It's now loaded. Uh, let's go back here. I'm just going to quickly exit this. 
Um, you also need to fix the permission on these files, obviously. So it's too open. So you gotta say chi mode and change 400 and GC RSA. That should be it. Now let's try connecting to this instance. So if I say SSHI and GC RSA and the username would be bitnami at then you need your IP address so let me get my IP address which is here so that's your instance IP address and type that in and hit enter it's gonna say that the host is not it's not known because this is the first time you're connecting to that one but if you're sure that this is the same host as you can tell by the IP that's the one you entered so you just say yes and it's gonna add it to your host name it's gonna ask for the passphrase again so just enter your passphrase and there you go you're connected to your instance how cool is that so let's exit this and I'm gonna teach you the next is how to set up your FTP so exit this guy the problem here is I need to copy the GC RSA pub to outside this SSH folder so it can be seen by my FTP client so I'm just gonna copy GC RSA pub and I'm gonna quickly move it to my desktop and I'm gonna say GC RSA Okay, so just a quick correction on that one. Copy the private key, not the public key. So open your FTP client. What I have here is FileZilla. You could download it for free. And once you have file, I'll put the link on the download on this video. On FileZilla, just go to settings. Under settings, go to FTP and then SFTP. And under here, click on the add key file. And then select your private key so it's gonna detect that it's not in the format that FileZilla wants so it would automatically convert it for you so just click on yes and it's gonna ask for the passphrase and okay and it's gonna ask forward save then I just say GC or say PPK and click on OK and then from your site manager either this button click on this and then click on new site and I'm gonna say YT and put in the host name so the host name would be the IP address similar to the one you enter on your shell so put that there and the protocol you change is to SFTP and for the login type change it to key file and put it bitnami as the user browse for the key file that you just created the ppk one then open then let's try to connect so it's going to say the same the uh, host name is not known and we want to trust it so just click on ok it's going to ask for a passphrase again and click on OK and there you have it you're now connected to your instance via SFTP and then you can start moving your files around and upload it on your uh, instance so hope you like this tutorial uh, I'll be adding more on how to uh, point your domain to your new Google Cloud instance uh, please subscribe to my YouTube channel bye for now